when it's okay to start it. Sounds good. So I just typed, I tried to type twitch.tv slash B to see if my autocomplete would just do it. And then it gave me this weird long hash of characters, which oh. my autocomplete wondering when the hell I ever did that. Yeah. <laughs> it was an, it was an image. It was like a, it was, it was like coding. No, it's street. just that there's a lot of people who search that. So yeah. Ah, I see. Like, it's like, it goes directly to like one of those uh, ASMR channels where they're like frying bacon on a gigantic weird, like metal ear. Oh yeah. There's all of it. I remember when in one of those streams, I got banned on Twitch for like a week because <laughs> I, I kept asking them to, because they were making like these popping sounds back and forth on each ear. I'm like, that, I was like, sure. And then I just like, I just typed, thought it would be funny. I just typed, can you do the Seinfeld theme? And I immediately got banned. <laughs> <laughs> right away. No means around here. I was like, come on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, even if you're into this, that's really funny. Come on. <laughs> All right, I got that posted, and uh, I'm, I'm good to start personally. Right. Well, let's start it. We're gonna play Metroid Dread. I also forgot the amiibo. And uh, we may have to turn the volume down on it. <clears throat> on like in game, if there's such an option. Uh, yeah. Um, let me. Because yeah. the cool thing about this setup is how loud it's coming out in our ears. It's pretty close to. What it sounds like on stream. Close to what it'll sound like on stream, too. Okay, well, that's good. So, right now it's kind of loud, right? I think it's fine. Yeah. Well, maybe I'm good. full of shit. Maybe, maybe it's just excessively quiet for us. And it will be louder. It <laughs> could be. Because I remember having... Yeah, we... the same as the <laughs> yeah. I hope Norm can tell us. <laughs> I believe it's. Yeah, no, like... Oh, they still only give you three? Yeah, they still stupid. Like, points. Oh, audio is good? Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. Sounds good. This game. Well, this, I'm not doing hard mode. Hard mode sucks. Yeah. We'll do normal mode. <laughs> yeah. So kind of what I understand about I have I actually haven't played this. So I'm super big into the Super Metroid specifically. Here is something organized that drain energy from its prey through physical contact. Metroids were originally created by the Chozo and named after their word for ultimate warrior. Oh, go good. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> their, their value as a bioweapon sparked several uh, crises, 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 and as a result, uh, all traces of them have been eliminated. They are now extinct. A gelatinous parasitic organism. Right. That's, that's, the that's all in the uh, infusion, right? Yeah. That's the, Those are the, the things things that are supposed to kill the met no, no, the no they, they, they explain they explain it in this. Oh, okay. Um, they explain it. Uh, it is just to the planet SR three eighty eight. It it could absorb the DNA of its host, living or dead, and replicate its form. When infecting a living host, it could even access the host's memories. Ex parasites were driven not by emotion, but by the instinctive need to replicate and spread to increasingly stronger hosts. Their inability to be controlled marked them as even more dangerous than their sole predator, the Metroids. Like the Metroids, they are believed extinct. So, like, to answer your question, basically, like, the experts, the Metroids were, like, created to eat those. No. And then they were too good at it. <laughs> so they killed them almost to extinction and then, like, started eating everything else. Okay. With no Metroid surviving on SR388, it became infested with the X uh, X horrifying parasites. Um, that's with the X, eh? Horrifying parasites came along with dating anyone being unaware of this. I set foot on the planet, got infected, and almost died. So, a fun funny thing is that, like, I can't remember if it's canon or not, so like, this might be, I might be just fucking wrong, but, like, the animals you save from, uh, 
the end of, of Metroid, the Super Metroid, are the, they're infected with the X. Oh, oh fuck! Yeah, they they, really? they were like helping you because they want to stop the Metroids. They hate them. Oh. And then they just I didn't like, know about that. Then part. when the new Metroids were gone, they were like, Dude, hell yeah, let's do it. <laughs> like, okay. I didn't know that bit. Yeah. I might be wrong though, because like I don't remember where I heard that thing months and months ago. Yeah, that's fusion. The only thing that saved me was a vaccine created from the Metro DNA, uh, which also left me uniquely able to absorb, sorry, to oppose the X. Uh, this ability was tested immediately when I went to a, uh, a bio yeah, Biologic Space Laboratories, BSL for short, research station to investigate a distress signal. That's the... Hello, me. Yeah, he got that fucking thing. There I battled many powerful X forms, including the SAX, uh, which was the X mimicking me in my power suit uh, at full strength. I eventually eliminated the X Menace on SR388 by setting the BSI <laughs> <Why? laughs> <It's your story. laughs> on a collision. No, that's just what you do. It's just yeah. Like, yeah. Samus just does big genocide. <laughs> Samus has never been anywhere like... that she didn't blow the fuck up. <laughs> yeah. After that, the X and Metroids were just memories, or so we, or so we thought. Just when it all seemed over, the Galactic Federation received a mysterious video transmission. Port on my roommate's door. <laughs> <laughs> Here, you can see some ghost activity <laughs> on the left side, barely visible on <laughs> camera. It showed an X alive and in the wild. Uh, thorough analysis proved the video was real, although the sender was unknown. It's just deep fake. Yeah, it's just a fucking like a shot from the movie Blubber. <laughs> and it's like you just hear like fucking Eddie Murphy in the back. <laughs> just like I love Blubber. <laughs> Some shit. Uh, the traffic <laughs> was traced. How are you gonna love Blubber? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Settle down now, y'all. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It was called ZDR. If the X had somehow escaped extinction out there, they would pose they would pose a threat to the entire galaxy. The Galactic Federation dispatched a research team of seven EMMI to investigate. We got a needle for a head. <laughs> An EMMI or ME is a is a large. Research robot designed to capture field samples and extract the DNA. Their incredible mobility and, pr and uh, protective plating, made of the strongest stuff in the universe, uh, practically guaranteed the mission success. But oh no, they were too strong. <laughs> but not long after their arrival on ZDR, all communication was lost. And I've got clamped the fucking Federation's mess of fucking game. <laughs> It's like we sent seven drones and they all got like, fucked. Yeah, yeah. The sick time like a bunch of Floridians yeah. threw yeah. beer bottles at them and knocked them out of the sky. I strapped it to a gator and now it's my gator drone. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening on CDR? Is the, uh, uh, is the, is the planet yeah. plan really impressive with X as the only, uh, only one immune to the parasites? It's up to me to go there and find out. So that's what I'm doing. I'm going there to find out. You're going to fuck around first. I'm going to fuck around a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Is it not the way we men of science to fuck around that we <laughs> might find out? <laughs> this is a dude with like no thumbs saying he's like, yeah. Hell yeah. Lambert has <laughs> got to push the X button. <laughs> You can go there and figure out how to eat the X like a big hamburger. <laughs> we got bagels! Woo! You will soon be entering ZDR's atmosphere. Yes. Yeah. Hey, I got you. Are you sure? Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, this mission does not seem appropriate. I'm guessing you want to go Probably not. 
entering the atmosphere in T minus 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yamcha. Oh damn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> His cell just killed me. <laughs> Fucking whoever. I remember it was like Cy mm -hmm. Cyberman. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Clean it up, Seamus. So that like robot AI voice that we had earlier, that's actually like Adam. But it's not actually Adam, it's like an mm -hmm. AI that thinks it's Adam. Um, yeah. yeah. So it's like that's a whole thing. That elevator leads to the depths of an underground facility. Signal quality is not really low. Remote communication remains neutral. Try to connect to the facility's network when you reach the bottom. That way, you can remain in contact. Any objections, maybe. Oh, they kept that from other um. I think that was in uh, fusion. Okay. Other other M is getting another M. Too. Other M gets a little bit like retcon just because of the fact that the AI has this voice. Yeah, it like completely removes a lot of things about Adams. I was like, okay. <laughs> well, look at this fucking pimp. I'm gonna dip on this fogly pimp. <laughs> Damn. Whoa. He's uh, got an arm cannon too. Yep. Yeah, it looks like a fun boss fight. You have too many powers, give them to me. <laughs> Alright, we got gameplay. Hell yeah. <clears throat> this game's pretty great. It's got <laughs> saving, but it's great. Oh yeah, he's sliding. Uh, hey, Mega Man! The ability to open up doors is a sacred Chozo ability. Yeah, the, the, that, the, cho the Chozo That is not to be taken lightly. You need to prove that you can handle the responsibility <laughs> to open doors with a gun. <laughs> to shoot doors open. Oh, cool. Well, wall grabbing? Yep. Smoking weed and cracking meth and eating feces. Oh, that's the yeah. That's the fanfare song. That is that's what it sounds like. We do talk about smoking meth and eating feces. <laughs> the ancient shows of tradition. <laughs> Being giant birds, they hey, love it. It's it's sacred. <laughs> it's sacred crack. <laughs> Uploading data. So, you've accessed a network station. Well done, Samus. I have reviewed your vital signs and video log from the data you uploaded. I've run a full analysis, but I cannot account for why you lost consciousness. My readings indicate dramatic physical changes in you. Whatever caused these changes seems to have stripped you of most abilities. You might call it...
physical amnesia. <laughs> That's so stupid, yeah. That brings me to your assailant. Fuck I yeah, I would know. Federation database against your video lock. It appears to have been a Chozo. The attacker's identity is not yet clear. I have the the Chozos are like an ancient civilization, right? Yeah, they've, they've been built up for a long time. They have, uh, on the they, tra they like raise salmon. Yeah, after her parents were like fucking murdered by Ridley. And, uh, they also like built all these like incredible structures and like different like ancient things all over the fucking like universe yeah. and they dropped there there are like all sorts of archaeology discovery he's like well yeah over. there's like tons of like little things you find and a lot of the upgrades you get are like in chozo like statues and things that they've built that are already on planets so like that's that's a whole thing this game has the most lore about that than any game before this like i think you get like a bunch in metroid prime and then that's kind of where you do that's where it stops you don't get a lot more this game kind of starts answering questions and shit, so like, if you like know a bunch about Metroid, you're gonna be like, holy shit. <laughs> like, I can't believe that's what that is. Um, this planet appears to consist of multiple areas, shuttles, elevators, and other modes of transport connect them. Keep an eye out for ways to reach the surface. The ship's location is marked on your global map. Check it for yourself. You may encounter pockets of low temperature. Your Metroid DNA renders you vulnerable to such environments. Spending time in cold areas will be harmful. Also, your human DNA does that too. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're just a cocktail of weird shit. Like, <laughs> like your human DNA makes you susceptible to cold too. Yeah, but it's like way worse. Yeah. <laughs> there are many such cold areas scattered underground. Do not enter them with your basic power suit. One final thing. Underground interference is preventing radio transmissions. Check in with me at any network stations you find. I think I, uh, I played a little bit of this at your house on Halloween last year. Jesus. And it was fucking dope as hell. Oh, that, that's from that remake. Yeah, the, that's the from the Metro 2 remake. Yeah, it, it's a good one. That wasn't AM2R, which was yeah. really good. Yeah. Yeah, the AM2R is like my favorite for that game, but the one that they made is not bad. Yeah. I really like the the design of that enemy you just killed. <laughs> yeah, it's just like a like a wanky, blowy <laughs> porcupine. Yeah, it's just like oh fuck, I gotta get out of here. Yeah, <laughs> I got a boogie. <laughs> do, 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 do. Yeah, <laughs> this fucking song. Way past cool. Look, we're way past cool at this I'm point. Juice and loose. <laughs> And the time has come to juice and loose spells. spells. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna juice and loose! So <laughs> that he slams a fucking big bat bottle of Jack onto the table. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what was that one video of those guys just like throwing a MacBook down the stairs and every time they throw it they go, Oh god, that <laughs> <really weird. laughs> <laughs> like, and then they pick it up again and throw it, and then they all just go. <laughs> you know, the way they were doing it, it was like a bunch of fucking monkeys. It was like, what is happening? Like, yeah. Oh, that was so fucking funny. Hope a tank doesn't totally come out of nowhere and own me. <laughs> Ooh, 
Oop. Ooh. From what I hear, the timing on that's really tight. Yeah, the, the stronger em enemies that you fight, it's like you're going to be possible after like the second one. It's like for, I can't, I can never get them. There was, there was one time I did, I, I was like fighting one and it was like really tough and I just, I somehow kept getting those. And I was like, how am I doing this? <laughs> <laughs> Those big uh, mother brains. Yeah. But you you see more of those in Metro Prime Three. Okay. You actually get to see them like in use and like what they're supposed to do. Oh fuck! Uh, if you haven't played that game, it's a good game, but I don't know. It's kind of lost media a little bit now. So if you can get it, go ahead and play it. I have it. Fuck yeah! Hey, and I got the Wii hooked up right there. There you go. Yeah, it's. I also game. haven't played it, but it's real good. Oh, I gotta do this. I forgot. I yeah, gotta... yeah, definitely. Like, uh, these, uh, from what I understand, these Emmy are just kind of roaming around the map. And at times you can just run into them randomly. Not always. Sometimes it's scripted, but yeah. So you gotta get like this hyper beam shot to kill them. Yeah, and you only get um, one shot, right? No, you you get uh, you, you have it till it dies. But, oh, like, you. But the fact is that they're all they're chasing you and shit, so it's like you have to get in the right spot yeah, to hit them to long enough it. to get through both of their armors, um, so you can actually kill them. Okay. <laughs> so uh, these are real motherfuckers of enemies. Yeah, they're they're, they're pretty cool. I, I do like the enemies. They were a good, they were a good uh, addition to add. The, the that's FAF. that's where the dread part comes in. Besides the actual dread part. <laughs> <laughs> that's where the feeling of dread comes, <laughs> yeah. versus the actual dread, which is a thing. Yeah, there's just some dread. <laughs> oh yeah, there's some. There's some dread in the lore. Just got my last thing. That's my dread and butter. I never fuck it up. That's my dread and butter. Oh my god. <laughs> and this uh, sounds like... I don't know what that sounds like. <laughs> sounds like a stupid ass thing to say. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a Dark Souls gate. Oh yeah. shit. <laughs> Also putting uh, being able to put map markers up, thank fucking god. Yeah, that's that's really <laughs> fixes this. Like game that's a lot. such a huge, could, like helpful feature in any Metroid. If I could do that in the first one, I might be able to play it. Yeah, yeah. Like Metroid One for the NES. Yeah, I mean, like if they just remake that or just like do like uh, yeah. Zero Mission or whatever. I I heard like. No, never mind. What I was thinking was uh, Metroid Pinball oh. was the same, like, canonically as Metroid Prime was. Oh no! <laughs> but, but, like, it it tells that same story. <laughs> I think so, does it? I think for so. some stupid reason. Look at that Metroid Prime one. Yeah, was out of the time. So. Yeah. I like the way it like moved back there, like when it was went from standing to like chasing you. The way it like bent backwards and then yeah, it ended pretty, up on all fours. Oh, so so those doors take a while to open. Um, if the Emmy is alert to you, it won't open. Oh. You have oh, and if you the room and alert to you, it won't. If the Emmy can't reach you and like basically gives up, then it opens back up. Yeah, that's some because the Emmy has like control over that over your escape. Room. They they did a good job making the music stressful. Oh yeah. With it, it's it has a lot of do 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 like energy to it. Yeah, it kind of got a little like, bit. Like, oh shit, I got spotted. <laughs> what was that? And now I'm in danger. I fucking love the lightning so much. I'm 
uploading data. Oh shit, the orb is pondering you. Oh, fuck. They may have been hacked. If so, it's reasonable. Somebody hacked it. I mean, they like, changed their source code. Now they, like, make source filmmaker porn with them. <laughs> Emmy sent out callers to detect vibrations in the air within a certain range. Essentially, they can hear you. Upon detecting vibrations, an Emmy enters surveillance mode to track their source. Stay out of its line of sight when this happens. Otherwise, the danger to you increases dramatically. It would have been great information to the have a second ago. Yeah, pursuit. Part of the pursuit protocol is to seal the Emmy zone exits. You will be trapped inside. To survive, you must leave its range of pursuit. If so it's Emmy you who's locking me in there? This will also <laughs> unseal the exits. An Emmy oh, the Emmy's locked the doors. Assigned, so their control okay. system must permit them to operate only within that range. I estimate a 99% probability of death if an Emmy captures you. There may be a very small opportunity to escape, but exploiting this window will be virtually impossible. And then said they have fucking shit. Sure. It's real hard. <laughs> it's like if you can do frame perfect tricks. <laughs> sure. Yeah, there, it's it's really. Like sometimes I don't even know when when I'm supposed to be getting it. I'm like, there's no way. Your highest priority in an Emmy zone could be simply to survive. Is that a charge shot? Glop, man. Welcome to Goopy Glop. I was wondering where the fuck there is so much like meat in the walls and why it blows up. <laughs> like I never, you never really get an answer to what the fuck those are. Same universe as Castlevania. Okay, that's true. It, it could be. There's no reason for to believe it wouldn't be. Yeah. <laughs> it's just explosive meat that they put in there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, because like Castlevania is so far in the past is here. that it could just have happened in this universe. The 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 wall chickens evolved into <laughs> into like throbbing weird, yeah, like fucking wall meat. Weird throbbing pustules that explode. Oh fuck! Oh. They explode to try to avoid uh, being eaten, but speed booster for that. This shit is intense. This shit is I like inside it. tense. It is bananas, B A N A N A S. <laughs> <laughs> Norm says, thousands of years after Dracula's curse is lifted, the wall chicken dissolved into crude oil. <laughs> <laughs> wall chicken Whoa. scientists are trying to master the. There you go. Master the art of turning wall chicken into fuel. In the future, that's the only way we can survive. Oh, I think you keep him down. Okay. The fuck out of here. He called the fuck out of So, so that... That is spot that, where it last... Yeah. Thought you, yeah. Where it last hurt you, or if you do stuff, but... Okay. Gotta morph. Yeah, this one's for you, boy. This game goes a weird, weirdly amount, a weirdly long amount of time without a morph ball. Yeah, I did hear about that. Yeah. Want that so bad? <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, it's a good thing to have. Especially now. Can I, can I get myself in there? I don't know if I can kind of cheat this.
I do also really like Samus's new suit. It's like a really good combination of fusion suit and uh, new stuff. Because the fusion suit, like, the last form and the first form look good. The middle form sucks. Yeah. <laughs> it looks yeah. like really gross. It's like boogers. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> they like pick a color scheme. It's like this green snot color. It's really bad. <laughs> I've been playing a lot of Earthworm Gym. Oh, nice. They put it on the, uh, those, like, free games for the Nintendo Switch. subscription. Yeah. Hell yeah. And there's a part in Earthworm Gym that I fucking hate. It's just, like, you're, like, underwater and it's the, like, bath is for your thing. And it's the worst thing I've ever done. <laughs> oh, it's so bad, and it makes this terrible sound. <laughs> Welcome to the Amazon Network. <laughs> Alexa has been downloaded. <laughs> do you want to order a perfect grilled cheese? <laughs> I do want a 55 gallon drumaloon. <laughs> it looks like you purchased a lot of big ass dildos. You want a 55 gallon <laughs> drumaloon? <laughs> wow, these. Unpredictable market predictions are going up. The How do they know? <laughs> How do they know about what my blood was? If you, if you <laughs> like <this> giant <laughs> bad dragon wolf dildo, yeah, you, you might want, like. You want the you want the the screaming spicy wolf guy. <laughs> you might. His name is Hector the Screaming Spicy Wolf. <laughs> you might like flaming hot, fifty yeah, five gallon, flaming bl bl hot, <laughs> flaming hot capsaicin lube. Yeah. The only thing that with ghost pepper. Up there. Yeah. yeah, ghost pepper is really really spice up the bedroom this this weekend with uh, our sale on spicy fucking lube. <laughs> It's like it's just like the it's just like how you get them. I hate this room. This is like the ground. At least you get like a visual representation of the range. Yeah, you're like you're in range. Oh yeah, yeah it's, it's good. It's oh no, I need to. I need more water. <laughs> To get in there. I need more allowance. You're lazy. Why? Because I do. <laughs> Sorry, that was a hit song by the Beats. Yeah, you wouldn't know that unless you're a real gamer. Unless you're a true 90s kid. Yeah, a true 90s kid. No, those fake ones. Not one of those Doesn't people matter. pretending to be a 90s kid. Yeah, you yeah. know, all of them. <laughs> all, all, all of the people who didn't grow up with something so they have no experiences. With it, trying to impress people who have <laughs> that <laughs> common occurrence. Yeah, happens all the fucking time. Great. Ooh. Damn. Nope. Nope. Bye. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Have a good fuck you. Have a good <laughs> fuck you. Have a good fuck you. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, I text my roommate that I got you. <laughs> oh. I just realized. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, got, I forgot because I was doing too much. Well, we got taken in by the excitement of everything. Oh, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. There you go. So I had a G Fuel earlier today. Nice. Thinking I was going to exercise. Now I feel like my heart's going to stop. Oh, yeah. hell yeah. So that's cool. <laughs> Don't do that, kids. Ever. Never drink it. Even if it is Elden Ring. <laughs> <laughs> Even if it's your favorite streamer. <laughs> it's also way easier to do wall jumps now. Yeah. You can just hit the button. I don't know how I feel about that, but... <laughs> When you like get up against the wall and you hit the button, you just you just do it. You just do it. It does. It's not like a hit a direction thing. Do it. Yeah. Which I think is good. Oh, that's a cold. Oh, the cold is localized out there. 
kind of trickier when they're doing that, so you know exactly how bad it can be. Okay. Good, like, good shit of teaching you what's up. Is this us again? Charge. Good. <laughs> no, it's actually more like. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> it's my charge bullet. <laughs> Every time Come I down at the exact same force of a regular bullet, it just. Yeah. I had to wait for it. Yeah, I have to wait for it to come out really strong. Just like, so that I know that I want to do this. Yeah, I mean, it gives me a bunch of choices. <laughs> <laughs> it gives me all the, the consequences. Yeah. What am I doing? Let me flip. I can just shoot the crab, it looks like. Yeah. I gotta do the parry more often because it gets you a lot more health back. Look <laughs> at this little guy. Yeah, I love him. Little screen guy. I'm gonna keep him and hug him and love him. Call him George. Call him George. <laughs> Have you guys seen the the, uh, the new Looney Tunes cartoons that are just like the old ones that they made? No. They're really good. Oh yeah. It's like actually like exactly what they should have done years ago. Yeah. Hell like yeah. all of the different like iterations and spin-offs of the Looney Tunes that they've done and just like Whoa! Yeah, it just got crunched. What a what a crazy speedrun trick you just pulled there. Yeah, that that was me doing a damage boost. Yep. <laughs> yep, well it saved it saved you like look at our final run time with it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it speaks for itself. <laughs> there's, a few, there's a few nanoseconds that were saved. <laughs> that gave me the uh fucking championship. <laughs> <laughs> you just rack up credit card debt with a gun. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was responded to Norm's comment there. Yeah, like a charge shot just like <laughs> it just charges your fucking Amazon account to buy bullets. Because <laughs> you just used one as a buys you a box every time you shoot. Yeah, it's it's like HP instant ink. It keeps track of the bullets you oh, shoot. <laughs> And then it automatically orders more when I you think I forgot about that low. shit. Fucking a subscription me. service for ink. <laughs> I fucking hate the hate cat. Push it. Push it hard. You office max sluts. <laughs> Push it! <laughs> now wear the approved office max outfit. You mean the mankini? Yes. <laughs> now dance. Okay. I guess I have to. You want to be a star, don't you? No. You want to be employee of the month? <laughs> you want to be employee of the month? I just don't think it's fair for a new person to be employee of the month. <laughs> <laughs> I've been here for years and I've only got employee of the month every month. <laughs> oh my god. Not this one though. Oh, I've been back here now. Let me get back here. This is where I will begin to start being lost. In the world. This is not too bad though. The beginning of this, it it get there's a certain like there's like an underwater level. It gets like kind of oh a Metroid underwater level you get lost in. Yeah, it gets hell like, yeah. A little, a little hard to know I, where the uh, fuck I am. I'm familiar with those. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime I'm doing a randomizer, which I haven't done in a while. Oh, this is the one. I, this is the enemy I get to kill then, because the yeah, the big brain it. woke up. I are the big brain. I are the greatest. <laughs> I are going back to my own world, <laughs> to my home planet for no reason. <laughs> Must have said that like a million billion times, and it still makes me laugh. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go through that room with him in there. Oh fuck. Oh. Oh fuck. Oh, oh he's on that side. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. <laughs> oh, this game also has the dumbest like way to open doors you, you, you'll ever see. Like just like mechanically. Okay. Like not video game mechanics, just like real world like yeah. physics. It's just like that's the dumbest thing. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's the same fucking room. I didn't even realize. Ah, <laughs> oh, they've made it slanted, so I can't. 
Yeah, yeah, you can't jump off a slanted thing. What? It's just impossible. The brain is awake, so I need to be in here. So where... I can't do that yet. So that's a trick. Oh, okay, can I go up there? I don't have double jump or space boots or whatever. And this door is the dumb door that... <laughs> you will never guess what powers that door. It's powered by pulling. Nope. Is it powered by that, like, platform? Nope. Even dumber. Fuck. Do you want me to tell you what it is? No. Okay. No, I, I gotta see this. Alright. <laughs> it hits a whole lot of bullshit to get them to open, and it's really funny when... <laughs> what powers them? <laughs> Like, whoever designed this was like, I gotta use this, so... I... <laughs> <laughs> there were, like, Dark Souls, it's just a crank across the we map. Just, we just invented this this new technology, and, like, they want us to incorporate it into all of the, our doors going forward. Yeah, we have, like, a... To drive up sales. We got a, like, $50 million contract. <laughs> we gotta we got to honor our end of it by using this The funniest technology. thing about it is it's, like, closer to steampunk technology. Oh, goddamn. It's really bad. Okay. It's, like, really much bad for a Metro game edit. Uh, uh... Okay. <laughs> Dump hot coals on it. <laughs> it's a coal-powered door. You're getting close. Alright, I am not entirely sure. I think I have to leave and then come back into the zone spot, probably. That does happen sometimes. Oh, get fricked! Get punched. If you don't frick my buns, I'm gonna frick yours. Is that actually, is that enemy? A thing from, like, many bosses later? Because I think that might have been something. Hmm. Oh, I didn't go to that room. Should probably go Very inscrutable. <laughs> I should be checking the map one. It's kind of like walking around. Oh, oh. I, I did that to myself. I wanted to go back for the missile. And I you got the sex you. number health, though. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, shit. Don't I, take any damage or pick up any health. Any health yeah. <laughs> 